suppose I'll stop in here at the Red Rocket. Give myself a nap. Can't remember where I put my bed. Also, I have a level up. I should take that real quick. I forgot how to level up again. And I've still got one star of Gunslinger I can put in. I kind of want to put it in Demolition Expert or Heavy Gunner, though. Just because they need it the most. I can't put any more in Bloody Mess yet. I, at some point, need to put a couple points in Local Leader, or in uh, Charisma, so I can get Local Leader, so I can start making the settlements more useful to each other. I also kind of want to put one in armor, Armorer and Science at some point so that I can start modifying the power armor. Because I enjoy modifying the power armor. It's kind of like modifying a car to me. Didn't get it from the fact that I'm a mechanic in real life and the nickname Gearhead. I'm a car guy. At some point I might put car videos on this channel too. I haven't decided yet. I think I'll go ahead and just put it in Heavy Gunner for now. Just so I'm getting that leveled up too. Nap time! Use a hand. Man, it's already one in the afternoon on here. Tell us apart. Yeah, I guess we did go all the way from the co-op up here, which probably took a couple of in-game hours. And now we're heading back down. You know what I didn't do when I was there? Readjust my weaponry. <laughs> I've got a limited amount of, like, ammunition on most of my weapons. That's alright, I can make do with what I have. What's the worst that could happen? Ruh row. I'm burning through fusion cores too. That's fine, I'm pretty sure I have a dead Brahmin. He's got some stuff on him. Red stags. I'm not worried about them right now. Carry weight's been a lot better to manage since I added a thing to uh, heavy or uh, to strong back. I'm pretty sure I left some fusion cores at the place we're going. It's another rad stag. I thought it was Yagwai for a second. But yeah, I feel like I left some fusion cores at. Uh, what's going on over here? Hey, get out of here. How am I not hitting you? I will take that meat. I didn't need it, but I'll take it. You earned that. But yeah, I think there's a few at Grey Garden. What are you doing, Raider Lady? How the hell? You broke my battle boat. Oh hey, I didn't even see this guy. Can't you see I'm raiding your stuff, Raider? How rude. Oh, that truck's about to explode. I was like, what was that? I wanted to look at that tent that I have never noticed was on the back side of this trailer. I don't know if there is anything to it. I didn't want to get near that though. Nope. Just a tarp someone draped over and probably slept in at one point. We shall be on our way. more gunners, aren't they? Yep. You gonna fire on me? You gonna let me be? Nope. You're gonna fire on me. I wasn't looking for trouble, necessarily, but I was here to take it if you were dealing it. Dellin? Dealing? Dellen, that's what I said. That eh, car's gonna explode. Cut. 
Come on. <laughs> that shot was better than I expected. I straight up edge shot her. I didn't really mean to. It just kind of where my uh, sight landed. I thought it was impressive. I mean, yeah, I meant to do that. I totally meant to do that. I'm so great at this. Best there ever did was. This car is remarkably clean. What are you doing? Excuse me. Oh boy. You may want to keep your distance. What's the problem? Why? Are you threatening me? Nah, nothing like that. It's just, well, I think I ate a bad can of meat. <sighs> okay. Maybe it was three cans. Seemed what? pretty tasty at first, but now it's got my guts all in a twist. And, well, you can probably smell it from there. Long neck Lukowski's canned meat my ass. Long neck Lukowski's canned poison more like it. Here. I mean, it's only 200 years it. old. I'm never touching the stuff again as long as I live. Assuming I live through the day. <laughs> if you happen to see that Lukowski, tell him I hope he dies in a goddamn fire. Is this someone God. presently Sorry. canning meat? Probably better if you get going. If it's anything like last time, it's about to get kind of messy. Gross. Good luck. Hope you find some Beano. Pepto. Something. Hey, yeah, I'm supposed to run down here and meet Deacon. I totally forgot. Hi, Deacon. Bye, Deacon. I'll be back at some point. He'll be fine. He's a patient guy. We got some important business to take care of. <gasps> Yao Guai. I could stand to use that meat. Sorry, dude. Your sacrifice will not be in vain. So we're almost there. So there's the salvage yard. And they're right down the hill. Hard to see through the fog, though. That seems to continuously be a thing. I don't like the sound of the rockets. No, you don't. You asked for it. Is that it? Everyone alright? Did we lose any bots? You guys just get back to work like nothing happened, huh? Why did the turret not do anything? Did it fire? I don't think it fired. I guess I'll find out when I go back and watch the playback, but I'd, <laughs> I'd feel like I didn't see it fire at all. Anyway, while I'm here, I'll now reorganize my stuff. Could have sworn that I had more, I left a few fusion cores here, but apparently I only left one. This is where I left that plasma infused sniper rifle. I got stuff floating around all over the place. Oh, and the junk jet. I forgot about that. I'm resetting back down to two firearms and one my uh, Krem's tooth. And then whatever I have the most of uh, throwables for, I guess. This shouldn't take long. Ooh, another random raider just showed up. A couple raiders. Were we not done yet? Now the turret's doing something. And why am I not firing? What is happening? Did I put the wrong weapon up? I think I did. Okay, now I've got it situated. I've just got a pipe rifle and my uh, combat rifle. Where's that other raider? There were two. Oh, right here. Just randomly died. So I guess randomly showed up is actually what I'm trying to say. Ported powerful combat rifle. Is that better than what I got? Looks like they're essentially the same. Man, it's like you guys got a bunch of new fertilizer now. 
Is that too dark? Alright, let's go talk to Preston again. Good job, bots. Glad you're all alright. Get back up here and tell Preston we did this, and then we'll see about building this thing for Sturgis. I guess technically it's building this thing for us. Hey, someone... Someone killed the poop my pants guy. What happened? Was it the gunners? I mean, I'm pretty sure I killed them all. You. You killed poop pants guy, didn't you? How am I not hitting you? You will pay for your transgressions! That's for Poop Pants Guy. He can now rest easy. He has been avenged. I can't believe she killed Poopy Pants Guy. After he was so nice to me, he gave me the rest of his uh, bad meat that made him... Made him poop his pants. I'm nervous on people. Man, I'm sprinting everywhere trying to burn through these fusion cores. And <laughs> it's still not... Like, I, I guess I burned, like, through a third or a quarter of one just from Grey Garden to here. I just can't believe how many I've come across. I dumped a lot of them somewhere. Because I had nine or ten at one point, And I dropped most of them off. I think it was a hangman's alley. Preston, I'm back. That's me. Freedom's always worth fighting for. I'm trying to tell you that uh, I took care of that. S the raiders at Grey Garden. It's not like prompting me to talk to him. General. Preston. Why is it not prompting me to talk to him? Alright, well I'm going to take care of this thing for Sturgis. And then I'll try and talk to Preston again later. <gasps> Trash can Carla! So what's your story? Looking to trade? Rob me? Or just ask directions to Diamond City? I just want to trade. Threaten? Let's see what you've got. Oh, I have a little bit of everything. Is it? I... I almost oh, hey. you wouldn't. Hey, Vol vault Tech guy. Hey, now that you're back here in Sanctuary, how would you like a job? A job? For, for me? Really? Yeah, what do you say? Wanna work for me? Why do I want to send him somewhere else to work for me here? What are you doing? Hey there. You know what? Since we talked, I'm feeling swell. Look at the two of us here in Sanctuary. Prepared for the future. Traveling with you is proving to be They good. didn't tell me I'm much, needed. Vault Tech. Just to make sure everyone filled out their forms. I was supposed to win a pack of steak knives. <laughs> All right, well, I guess I'm going to work on this thing. Stabilized reflector platform. Should I just build it right here? All systems are a go, sir. All right. Talk to Sturgis. Sturgis! Sturgis! Sturgis. How's it going? Did you find a good spot to build your signal interceptor? Yep. Did you figure out the rest of Virgil's schematics? I think so. Best I can tell until we actually try to put it together. Here's a list of three things that may be harder to find. I think I'll be able to pull together everything else we're going to need. I'll meet you over at the building side and see if we can actually make this thing work. Build a console. Build a relay dish. Build a beam emitter. 
Can you explain how this thing is actually gonna work? Let me break it down for you. There's, uh, four main parts to this thing. One, a control console to input the code and process the signal. Two, what he calls a relay dish. That's what intercepts the, uh, the teleporter signal. Three, a molecular beam emitter. Gets pretty technical here, but, uh, looks like this is what translates your matter into energy for transmission. <sighs> Four, the stabilized reflector platform that you already built. That's what concentrates and reflects the molecular beam. One thing to keep in mind while you're building this, it all needs to be wired together so all the pieces can talk to each other. I'll see you over at the building site. Good luck. So then, do I already have... Yeah. I don't have a biometric scanner, which is hilarious, because I just dropped a couple because they were too heavy to carry. <laughs> Military grade what? Since it kind of cuts it off, and I don't know what it's saying. I can build the dish, though. Let's do that. It's supposed to be wired together. What am I supposed to attach it to? I know I need to attach it to that. But do I not attach it to this too? I'll figure it out later, I guess. You know what? Since we talked, I'm feeling sweat. Good. Glad to hear it. Here Might have a whole set of T60 I can give Nick. For them. I've almost got a full set of T60 for Nick to wear. Gosh, there's not even enough adhesive down here at uh, Sanctuary. Or I guess up here at Sanctuary. They didn't tell me much. Hey Preston, you gonna talk to me now? Do you think we're ready to retake the castle? Uh, I guess I don't need to talk to him about Grey Garden then. No, we're not ready yet. Your call. Just let me know when you're ready to pull the trigger. I kind of want to go ahead and take the castle, but at the same time, I don't know. Military grade circuit board, that's what I need. Biometric scanner, build the beam emitter, build the console. So what was I missing? The scanner and the... Scanner and the circuit board were what I was missing, and that allows me to build those two things. Okay, I understand. Gotta build a couple more turrets while I'm here. Seeing as the sanctuary got attacked, and they didn't defend themselves very well. I was told if you get defense up over 50... Can I put this on top of here? That'd be awesome. You can just use the light... Light poles as... Look at the moon. Use light poles as supports for all this stuff. But yeah, so if you get you get defense up over 50, then uh, your settlement can defend itself pretty well. Let's put that to the test, shall we? Now we're at 54. Alright, well I guess since I'm going to have to find a military grade circuit board and a biometric scanner before I can do this, then I'm going to move on to a different quest and look for them as I go. I did tell Deacon that I would meet him at the old highway and help him out. Deacon wants to help join the rail... Wants, wants, Deacon wants to help me join the railroad. In order to join, I have to help him on a mission. He said he'd meet me by an old freeway outside Lexington. So I think I'm going to run down there and take care of that. First time I have a nap. And then while we're out and about doing other quests, I felt like there was more stuff at Sanctuary than there actually is. Yeah, I guess I'll just go ahead and sleep through the night and then we will go meet Deacon. Wow, Nick. Personal space, bro. <laughs> Wake up and he's just standing right there. Do I look like I want to chit chat? Do I look like I want to talk to you? She's always so mean. Random settler person. Hey there. Hi. How 
uh, how are ya? I I'm new around here. I just wanted you to know that I'm ready to do whatever it takes to make this into a real home. So, is there anything you need me to get started on? Uh, yeah. yes. Let me show you. Sure. I don't remember any of them ever wearing a Red Rocket t-shirt and jeans. Am I crazy? I'm playing the game completely vanilla. I don't have any mods on. I'm gonna set her up to be a guard personnel, though. Yeah, I don't recall anyone wearing that specific outfit. Let's trade. Go ahead. She doesn't have anything in her inventory in terms of clothes. I'm kind of weirded out by this, to be honest. I don't think I've ever seen that before, and I'm playing vanilla. Oh, you know what it is? There is a thing in the Creation Club that was free that had like Nuka Cola shirts and stuff. And I, because it was free, I went ahead and took it. I bet it's downloaded to the game. It's not technically a mod, like it is a mod, I guess, but it's not technically a mod. It's part of the Creation Club stuff. I don't know. I don't know how you look at that. Either way, though, it's on the game now. I'm pretty sure it's permanent. I bet that's what that's from, though. This stuff. Graphic t-shirt pack. I, I felt the need to show you guys. That's exactly what it is. Okay. Yeah, it's part of the Creation Club. It says it's installed. Because I downloaded it. Because I saw it was free. That's why... But yeah, it's in the Creation Club menu. So I've got these two. Customized vault suits. I always get the free stuff. Because I just like the added content to the game. But I'm still technically playing the game vanilla. I don't have any actual mods going. Kind of like that, though. It adds a little more color to the game. Color and li Adds a little more color and life to the game, I feel like. I wonder what I've got stored here. be funny if what I needed was right here. Nope, neither item. Alright, let's go meet Deacon. Now I'm going to have to keep a lookout to see what other t-shirts I see people wearing that I never saw before. Here's that dead cow again. Brahmin, excuse me. Same thing. Why is a Brahmin carrying a 10mm pistol? It must have been one badass Brahmin. Not badass enough though, or you wouldn't be dead. <laughs> 